All right, welcome back. We are looking at Ethereum right now. And well, Ethereum is kind of a mixed bag. So right where we are right now is still like a, you're still technically in like a distribution now. However, what you can take note of that is the utmost of importance right here is that, hey, you put this low right on over there. Or yeah, so you put that low in right there. You came up, you put this little local high in, then you made a higher low, thus giving indication that you should move back on the up from there. All right, great. Now that we got that out of the way, the other portion of this is you did end up cracking through this prior high. So you could say that you have uh, argument to say that this does continue moving up. The only thing that I would say is that would caution this area as we have previously marked it. Now, that being said, should you end up moving up from here, next area to look out for is going to be this white box and then the line. Why are these areas? So this is going to be your other, oops. There we are. So this is going to be your area where you would probably end up getting rejected from. And then if you don't, you want to crack through at least that high right there at 1875. Should you end up doing that, then you'd be actually looking pretty Gucci gang for a chance of shooting back on up here. But if we do just take into context, this trend setting back from april of 2023 what have we seen here we've seen that this made a high it came down made this low you ended up breaking that low right over there you came back on up made a lower high and then you made a lower low breaking this one back here now we're moving back on up so based off of that what would we consider we would be able to consider that hey maybe we either get rejected here or we get rejected here and then head back on down but then let's say we just zoom out a little bit a wee bit further from the point. And what you can see ultimately is you put in a low back in June of 2022, push up, made a high, made a higher low, pushed up, made a higher high again. And then, well, here we are right now. So uh, overall area is that you don't want to break going to be that 1408 to 1391. Ideally, you don't want to break there. You want to hold there. But anyway, pushing up from here, should you end up breaking white line at 1875? Then you have a chance of moving back on up and then your main target is going to be breaking back above that really 2k mark. That's going to be your big psychological level. And then it's going to be about 2k. Uh, we're going to round up and say 2k 35, just that little bit right there. And then clearly after that is just breaking past the high at 2135. So other than that, what I kind of think ends up playing out right now is that I do want to see this end up holding and I do not want to see us break below really this low right here so uh 1644 even if you retrace a little bit I, that's like the last level that i don't want to see end up breaking um even like it, honestly even the yellow line that we had marked uh that's 1668 so i, I don't want to see either of those levels break uh as long as they don't break then we can still be looking for upside at least for the time being. But other than that, none of this is financial advice. These are all just my thoughts and opinions. And you guys have a phenomenal day as always. Adios, muchachos.